Connected. So this is, so if you get Spectrum Cable at home. Mm -hmm. Yep. So many, I'm um, also the story was like, oh my good heavens, this mm -hmm. is, there fun, fun features around this time. So. Sure. Yeah. Shy person, so. But you know how to advance. You just, the, these are the Dateline NBC. So tired of I know, yeah. we're all so sick of it. Yeah. Another... No, it's just the worst when you realize how much of that just keeps going on. And... The mail and found the thank yous. Um, this one starts from Kimberly. Hello, I'm writing to thank you for all that you have done to help me through these confusing times. Thank you for all of your support that you have given my sister and I, and I'm sure many other students as well, and for always being so accessible and patient with all of us. And not to be all, all done. done. <laughs> so, um, dear Mrs. Wolf, thank you so much for everything you have done for my sister and I throughout the last four years. I cannot find the right words to express my gratitude for all the help, support, and guidance that you have given us. So similar stories. They're thankful and appreciative, which is part of what makes a school counselor that fulfills our job is when you have that the gratitude. And, and, and you get to see they're identical in their, mm -hmm. but also in their purpose, it just seems, mm -hmm. you know. And, I mean, I know that they wrote those both from the heart, mm -hmm. but boy, I mean, just the... Mm -hmm. And mentioned each other in their first lines. They both mentioned, your... okay. Can you see, that? do I need to move my hair? Oh, it's fine. On this side? Okay. It's fine. Down over those cards. Oh, just okay. One more second. No, no, no. Okay. You're fine. You're fine. I'm just ordering. I'm just bossy. Okay. And some really cute shots okay. from all around your office because you have okay. so much good swag that just kind of paints the picture of. Okay. One. In the years to come, here in the halls of Beloit Memorial High, they will echo with the true story of two identical sisters who got full rides to Brown. t-shirts or anything yet that say brown on it yet so yeah it's we haven't even gotten our our actual physical gosh darn cool though not gonna yeah. lie to film with. <laughs> I like that. Dear Kimberly, congratulations. I am delighted to inform you that you have been admitted to Brown University's class of 2025. As we have throughout our history, Brown seeks to embody its mission of discovering, communicating, and preserving knowledge and understanding in a spirit of free inquiry. You were chosen not only for what we believe you can contribute to our academic community, but also for what you will gain from the wonderful opportunities that distinguish and define undergraduate education at Brown. We were inspired by the accomplishments that you shared through your application and you will join an impressive class of interest meet on the common grounds of creative thinking and intellectual curiosity. You and your future so from here to you guys. Let's see, I can do this without the window blurring. Oh, that's such a cute shot. 
looking down. I'm, I'm doing this. Think about this. Do you guys drink a lot of coffee? Are you guys... Oh, no. <laughs> yes. We actually, our little, like, tradition that we, that we have is when we stay up, we do our work here, and then if we want a break or if we just really want to step away for a second, we go to the living room and just have coffee and just talk. Just keep each other awake. Okay, so then I have a favorite... Yeah, we go, we buy these giant jars because we go through it so quickly. Team effort. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is how you get... Put more in that one. Just love the group effort. <laughs> go team, go. So maybe what I'll have you guys do. So you guys typically come. Let me see. Fresh shake. Hold on, hold on. Before you come out, hold on. I want to get that cute shot on camera because I love that you guys pick these up together. So. Hold Thank you for letting me get some fun shots. <laughs> special. Yeah, usually this happens at around four or five in the morning <laughs> and with pajamas, tears. It's very different. <laughs> it's gonna look very similar to that at brown, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah. Only like I said, you might be putting some brown sugar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know, it's because we would get really tired if we sat on the on the couch, so we just stay on the couch. Uh, that is so true. Well, I'm thinking. Guys, whatever you'd like. Ready? Go for it. And cheers, go for it. Oh, to brown. To brown. <laughs> Too cute. One shots. That is so cool. <laughs> Then I saw, so you guys have relatives in, in Tennessee. I'm from Nashville, so now I'm all curious. We're in Tennessee. Yeah, they're in Nashville. Are they really? Yeah. Oh, for sure. Usually a tradition we have with an unplug. Yeah, our parents have always emphasized one education and but also just being there for each other at all times. Proud. Yeah. But yeah, we're lucky though cuz we everything that we know, like our work ethic and just that thing about not limiting ourselves, we learn from them.
it's possible. Yeah, I hope he doesn't feel pressured, but I really hope he feels motivated. I... have it in this really pretty portrait mode, so it's kind of... Slow it down. Yeah, I thought it 